Denise. Hey. Hey, is, is Kevin Collins still here? I don't know. I haven't seen him in... Look, can... could, could you please find out? I'm, I'm not asking as a friend. I need him as a doctor. I, I've got to find out what is happening oh, to me. Oh, okay. Frank Scanlon? Who wants to know? You have to come with us, sir. Doctor's orders. Doctor's orders? What, what are you talking about? Kevin Collins didn't order this. No, he didn't. I did. <sighs> what? Karen, Karen, what is this? I'm sorry. I didn't want to do this. I had to. Why? After you attacked Ricky at the bar, somebody called the police. They were going to arrest you, but I told them I was your doctor and that I was going to put you under 72 hours psychiatric hold. Psychiatric hold? It was either that or going to jail. And the way you've been looking at me lately, the, the things you've been saying... You're scared of me. I'm scared for you. This rage or whatever it is inside you isn't just directed at me anymore. If I hadn't come along when I did... I, I, I lost control. I admit that. You would have killed him. Ricky would be dead. I don't know what happened. You know, I wish I could believe it was some kind of poison, stupid candle. I so desperately wanted to believe That's you. That's got to be it, Karen. I am telling Frank, you that... There was no candle burning at the recovery room. I was so sure that it was some kind of weird reaction to the candle. If it was, God, there's, there's really something wrong with me. Frank, when you look at me, what do you see? I see the woman who's made me happier than I have any right to be. I mean it, Karen. In this moment, yes. I know you mean it. But what I meant is, what do you see when this feeling comes over you? No. No, I don't want to think like that. No. Frank, you have to, okay? I need to know. You need to know. What do you see? Close off right now. Ricky. You're letting him touch you. You're in bed with him. You're loving it. You're begging for more. Frank. What in the hell is wrong with you, Karen? You're a married woman. Frank, it's okay. understand when you just lashed out at me just now you asked me how a married woman could behave that way we're not married at least not yet but maybe if we were to get married you're worried that maybe i'd revert back to well you know there was a time when i took my clothes off for money frank you know that and no karen no i swear i never think about you that way when you called me a whore. I'm sorry, Karen. I'm so sorry. <laughs>